from Indy's streaming news leader. This is a WRTV update. I'm WRTV's Rafael Sanchez and these are your latest headlines. This morning there's a newly elected trustee in Wayne Township on the west side of Indianapolis. Jeff Barden replaces Chuck Jones. As you may recall, WRTV investigates learned that Jones and three other Wayne Township employees received compensation through a non-for-profit linked to the Wayne Township Fire Department. Late last month, all four pleaded guilty to conflict of interest charges. Starting today, several lanes of 38th Street will close for more than four months. This is all part of the public of the Purple Line construction. The closures impacts all westbound lanes between Keystone and Emerson Avenue. However, one eastbound lane will remain open. A traffic will be rerouted using 46th Street. Now, when it's up and running, the Purple Line will connect downtown Indianapolis with the city of Lawrence. The Indiana Black Expo celebration is underway and started here in Indianapolis. There are a number of events on the schedule just for today. The conferences start at 1030 this morning and will run all the way through the end of the week. You can find a full schedule of events on our website, WRTV.com. Each conference is free to attend. Now to check your forecast on this Monday, Todd Clausen is standing by. Hey, Raphael, it's going to be another hot day for us, but what's new? It's been a very hot summer for us so far, and today highs will top off right around 90 degrees. You'll notice the humidity come up just a little bit here throughout the course of uh, the day, but we're dry throughout the daytime hours. When you look at uh, this risk and a severe storm threat, and you see the slight risk to the north, marginal risk for the rest of central Indiana, just know that this is late tonight and more so into the overnight hours. We'll start to see some storms come in by 10 o'clock. They'll drop from north to south uh, through the area as we go throughout tomorrow morning's commute. The potential still for some uh, rainfall. Then the storms move to the south and the rest of your day tomorrow is going to be absolutely beautiful with lots of sunshine and a high temperature in the mid 80s. Uh, for more weather and stories that you need to know, please download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.